does the series 6 minus 12 fifths plus 24 20 fifths minus 1, 48 1 20 fifths plus dot 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 converge and if so what to? Well let's start by seeing if we can find a pattern in these terms because we certainly don't want to add them by hand. So we have 6 and then minus 12 fifths and then 24 20 fifths and then 48 1 20 fifths negative. And let's see if we can figure out what the next couple of terms would be. Notice that the denominators are actually pretty easy to figure out as we jump term from term. Each time we're multiplying the denominator by a 5. So that would be a times of 1 fifth times of 1 fifth times of 1 fifth times of 1 fifth all the way down. On the other hand, to get from here to here, we're multiplying the numerators by negative 2 each time. That makes the sign skip, and it makes them double. So if we multiply by a negative 2 fifths each time, we have a geometric sequence. And so that means we have a formula. The nth term is going to be the starting value, 6, times the multiplier, negative 2 fifths, to the nth power. And so now we have a formula for the nth term right here. So let's rewrite the series in this sort of new compact notation. Our series takes the form of 6 plus 6 times negative 2 fifths to the first power plus 6 times negative 2 fifths to the second power plus 6 times negative 2 fifths to the third power plus 6 da, 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 da. So what we could do here is we could pull out a 6 from all of these terms and we'd be left with 1 plus negative 2 fifths plus negative 2 fifths squared plus negative 2 fifths cubed all the way down the line. And so this is what our series looks like when we've cleaned it up a little bit. Now rather than actually adding up individual terms and trying to make an approximation, let's see if we can compare this to a series we already know using the heredity principle. To make it a little bit more obvious, let me let the variable x denote negative 2 fifths. And so our series here takes the form 6 times 1 plus x plus x squared plus x cubed plus x to the fourth all the way down the line. Now this expression right here is the geometric series, and we know that it sums to 1 over 1 minus x, and that that convergence uh, that holds as long as x is between minus 1 and 1 within the radius of convergence. And so we have 6 times 1 minus x. Now if we go back and uh, take a look at this value here, again, notice that negative 2 fifths is between 1 and minus 1. So it's inside the radius of convergence. That means if we back substitute it, we're going to have uh, 6 over 1 minus negative 2 fifths right here. If we were to clean that expression up, that's the same thing as 6 over 1 plus 2 fifths, or 7 fifths, and that would be the same thing as 30 sevenths. And so there's the sum of the series by recognizing it as a Taylor series.